everybody, it's Cliff Bernard from BaySupply.com, your riveting lock bolt and threaded insert specialists. We're here today with another one of our series of unboxing videos on a cordless tool that's just come out from Huck. It is the Huck Makita BV4500 18 volt lock bolt tool. Let's take a look at this, open it up, do an unboxing, and show you the accessories that come with it. It has a rigid case with nice durable locks. Inside the kit, we have the actual tool itself. We have two Makita 5 amp batteries, consistent with the Makita heavy duty line of lithium ion batteries that are being used on all of the Makita products you see in the market these days, cordless drills, screwdrivers, uh, saws. This is the same exact adaptation of that. And you have a uh, Makita 18 volt quick charger. You get two batteries, as I said, so you got two batteries here, another one here. And let's go through and show you how the batteries slide onto the tool and some of the features of the tool. So the tool has a removable pintail or mandrel collection bottle right here. It's a 5.5 pound tool. It has about an inch and an eighth of pullback stroke. It's got a nice belt buckle that you can use, a little belt buckle adapter to hang on the side of your belt. It's got adjustable power, which is one of the only tools on the market right now that actually has the ability to control the pull power, the, the pounds of traction power that this thing will actually stroke back on on the fastener with. So there's a, a button here with digital, there's three buttons here with digital controls of the pull power. And then you have the standard Huck nose adaptation setup that you would see on Huck's pneumatic line of tools. Many of the nose assemblies that are used on the existing Huck family of products for uh, pneumatic tools and their hydraulic tools will adapt directly onto this Makita BV4500 Huck tool. We're going to go through and place a nose assembly on this tool for you and show you how to use this tool on typical quarter inch or 3 16 diameter lock bolts. This tool is designed primarily for quarter inch and 3 16 diameter uh, lock bolts and also 3 16 and quarter inch diameter rivets as well. So let's take a look and put the nose on here and we'll show you how it works. So we're going to remove the outside nose assembly nut here. We're going to mount a 3 16 standard C6L Huck nose assembly on the tool. We're going to set some C6L fasteners for you. So this is a typical Huck nose assembly. We've got the inside section that holds the jaw that grabs the lock bolt, and we have the outside section or the anvil that will actually swage the collar onto the bolt when the trigger is pulled on the gun. So we're going to go ahead and thread this on the piston of the tool. And you'd normally take a wrench and lock this down, but this is just for demonstration purposes. You slide the anvil on and you put the locking nut right there on the end of the threaded shaft. Long threads. And then there's a lock nut on there to just keep that nut from moving. So we're all set. Then we're gonna slide the five amp uh, battery onto the tool, lock it in place. That's basically the stroke cycle, it's an inch it's 1.18 inches of stroke to be specific. It's about an inch and an eighth of stroke. So here we have a Huck C6L lock bolt. You can see the digital display on the tool right there for power. I've got this thing dialed up pretty high right now. You can see that we're using a, a steel 316 C6L lock bolt and we have a bunch of spacers on here to accommodate the length of the bolt and then a standard collar. I don't know if you could see that in my hand there. We're going to slide that collar on the end of the lock bolt. And that's basically to simulate like a truck frame or a, a grill on a, on a school bus type of a, a application. And you go ahead and you stick this in the end of the nose till it won't go any further. You pull the trigger and there you have a completed assembly. Beautifully swaged bolt, very quick, very easy, very durable, really strong tool. The, um, the nose equipment typically will release the spent mandrel or the spent pintail when you place the next fastener in the tool. So I have a second assembly here all ready to go like I showed you before. We're going to shove that in and you'll see that the stem is released into the collection chamber. Let's do it one more time just so you get an idea how it works. Really quick, not too loud, very durable. 
And again, with that adjustable digital stroke setting, really the cutting edge of the type of cordless tools that you see coming on the market these days. Uh, 18 volt, brushless motor, Makita durability, in a partnership that they've done with Huck exclusively to be able to set Huck fasteners. So that's it, that's our short unboxing video of the Huck BV4500, the latest in technology in cordless riveting and lock bolt setups from Huck, Makita, and their partnership together. Uh, we appreciate you guys being with us on these unboxing videos. We have a great technical support department at BaySupply.com. Visit our website, you'll see a complete line of Huck tools, Huck fasteners, Huck nose equipment, Huck repair parts. Our technicians are available for any consulting or questions you have on repairs or application design. We have a great automation design department as well, so if you're into a higher volume production and you want to get some ideas on how we can adapt tools to automated assembly lines, give us a call. Check us out online. Check us out on our Facebook site. Uh, give us a like if you see what you uh, if you like what you see. <laughs> and again, it's uh, Cliff Bernard from BaySupply.com. We thank you so much, and we'll look forward to seeing you on our next unboxing video.